Hi, I'm going to show you um, where I have the Azempia. Whether it's running or not is not important, but it's a new vanilla without this HR model or menu that I'm going to inject from here. You can see that I'm going to build a main menu with um, first window and a master detail human resource job destination with the following properties or fields. Notice that I have L hash in front of qualification and L hash in front of training type is referring to this list where qualification is all this. Uh, let me just remove one term here to show you how quickly I can inject all this thing in just from an Excel so that we do not need to do any programming. Let me save this. You can stop this. Uh, it does not matter because we're going to inject it to script, script control. I'm just going to show you that that reference is not in here yet. I go to uh, whatever is created today. You see that there's no record and it is running I can stop it if I want or I don't have to stop it and now I'll just inject this ninja shell that's it one two three you will see that um, there is uh, 24 reference list added and it's to add model entity and there are four worksheets so um, if I come here run this again you notice that I have this four um, added today July 26 5 26 a.m. yeah so if I go to the one that shows qualification you see that it's already been used by the new table here bachelor certificate diploma master's doctorate bachelor is rearranged alphabetically and is used inside this model qualification on the look at it let's go and log in to our garden world client and you see that it is here and it's a master detail here, the master first and the detail here down here let's put in something and the whole power of the Adempia is given uh, just like that, now we come to the uh, detail uh, let me so this you can pull because it's a text as you can see here is a text T hash this is how you program it and you can pull it up here I have lots of experience okay I put something my training type is following as what I've done uh, what if I want to add a field called unschooling let me save this first so you can see it now all I have to do is to add something here but let me move this out of the way on the list I'll put the word unschooling okay that's it uh, go back to the script and I'll just run ninja again and you will see this time one reference list has been added we'll come here uh, let me put a new field um, I'll, see, I'll show you how powerful it is second hopeless <laughs> guy and um, let me put this up experience uh, hard knocks why because oh it's not here easy just requery there you are unschooling 
magic mission train time you can add more if you want uh, but because this is the identifier the magic of input is automatically there and output too you can see here it's automatically to HTML I can push to Excel but here let me try PDF this is the power of Olympia you don't have to worry about the output you don't have to worry about the input but to set it up it takes a long time for most item peer implementers and developers they have to go through menu um, things like that and you have to create um, each one up you know like this okay and um, you have to create a window and when you open up uh, sorry you open up the window you have to create the two tabs human resource and job destination and every tab you have to define the table with the fields and um, how, how they look like um, you got to paint them you know? but now just doing this putting here or even making many many tables with just a ninja you will get them to be like this within four seconds have a good day bye from hong kong i'm redwan diwanir